To all people, helping them to go to understand Christ just as we have, and confess Jesus as Lord of their lives. Now, many of the times when I say sometimes you are healed in doing this, you also want to ask yourself, the attendance that was here for the Women's Day was exceeding 350. Uh, how many women are back uh, from that occasion? Now, it all depends on the response of not just only you, but also the others. But you also want to look at and understand why would the response be as it was. Yeah, we all had. What we want to look at that sometimes denies us the privilege and opportunity to be able to have the impact that will make people change what we call the weakest link. That is the time of my today. The weakest link. You want to identify what is your weak link. Hi guys, how you doing? I'm well. Just on the road, it's raining. It's a Monday afternoon. I'm going to visit a friend. Ah, almost cancelled out by men. We've been planning this thing for too long. So cancelling is not an option. So with the rains or not, I have to make my way there. Ah, it's not as bad as it seems. We just have to get there somehow. Look at the roads, all wet. Yes, it's a November thing. So it's always raining in November, so well, we have to do what we have to do. So here I am on my way to the bus stop. I've been given directions, so hopefully I get there in good time. So we'll catch up with you guys later. Situation. I have my umbrella, my hood. It's my outfit of the day. I'm warm enough since I'm going to be indoors. I guess it's well. Once I'm in the house, I'll be warm. Probably even remove the jacket, but well, I'm sorted. So let's go. I hope you guys are warm and uh, taking care of yourselves. The rain doesn't have to be all bad. We either enjoy the rain, enjoy being rained on, or just feel bad that we are getting wet. But the rain is a good thing. Thank God for umbrellas. Thank God that we can walk around it just like any other weather. Yeah. So it's not all bad. We keep moving. Keep moving and get things done. So I'm going to see a friend. We've been planning for too long. That's why cancelling was not an option. Though I almost cancelled because of the rain, but well, 
she didn't give me an option to cancel so I took the challenge and here I am so let's see you all there do whatever you may with that information I sound and to roast some salad oh yeah wow mm. eh Continue reporting. So I will let you know that we are behind you we are with you. Uh, we can only manage the pain that you will do. Uh, but we pray that God will be able to really hold your hands and be able to serve with you as a man during this very lifestyle. Um, so let me also welcome um, those who have come. Store. Mm -hmm. So let's actually just go back to your childhood. You, your mum uh, was trafficking drugs, mm -hmm. and you, at the age of thirteen, mm -hmm. um, found yourself in a house without a mother, with no running water. Mm -hmm. Because it's in these stories that you were able, I believe, to cultivate a skill set mm -hmm. that has allowed you to then take it into your adulthood. My parents are Jamaican descent. My mom didn't graduate from high school. At the age of seven years old, I knew what a key of cocaine looked like. Like, I could still remember what it looked like, what it smelled like. I could remember the people coming in and out of, in the, out of the house. I could see them right now, them talking about it. And